Hey guys, and welcome back to Fallout 4. Last episode, I nearly got my ass handed to me by um, the children of Atom that were at this place, which is called Kingsport Lighthouse. Yeah, real nasty, um, but we managed to get through it. Uh, and we're going to continue north on to Salem. So, let's just do that. We have some sort of metal building over here in the middle of the road. And a fight going on that way. Adam, is that you? Oh. Oh, I don't like I don't like that this is more children of the Adam. It was nothing. Do I hear whispers from the glow? Yeah. Whispers from the glow. That's what it is. Stop, lady. Oh. Come up here. <laughs> I am not getting in the way of three gamma guns. Hancock is basically invincible against these guys because he's a ghoul. So, uh, you know, you may as well just let Hancock deal with things. I could actually join in. I'm being a liar. I have combat rifles and even a sniper rifle. And these guys aren't ghouls, so I'm actually thinking that Gamma Gun might... What is the difference here? These ones are worse than this one, but they're... Oh, I see. One, This one has some sort of modification. Okay. They're not actually ghouls, so this should actually kick their ass. Whoa, 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 whoa! And mine! And mine! And cock! <laughs> the worst part about it is you have to have Radaway as well as Stimpat. Ow! Come on! Come on, you jerk, where are you? I can't even see you. This is doing nothing to them. Alright, they're special. They are special. Um. Fear you, heretic. Look, I don't want to be feared, I just want to get out of this alive. Every ear shall be stricken death given the thunder of his voice. No. 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 Yeah, okay. Um I kinda wanna you know, I did this with the uh the super mutants that one time. I kind of want revenge now. Damn it. Stop. Game. Please. Too much excitement. I am not stealthy. This character is not stealthy, nor is this character made for using these kinds of weapons, but you know, we can try. What have we got? No one visible. Turret. A quick save right here. Crater house. What? It's fine. That's not fine. What the heck? Someone has a fat man. Someone. Someone there has a fat man. Good. 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 Question is, who has the fat man so I can kill them? Is it you? Do you have the fat man? Run away! Run away, Hancock! Yeah. Whoa. 
nearly forgot about you. That's some radiation mining, by the way. Oh, it's not a fat man, they're throwing nuclear grenades. <laughs> yeah. Look. Uh how about you know that whole idea about revenge? I don't think I'm gonna get revenge. Um Take me reason I did that was that uh, I'm just not interested in spending that much right away. So I may as well just uh, pretend like there's nothing there. Hey, we're at Salem. How about that? Private Hearts Holotech. Okay. Investigate the Museum of Witchcraft. That's, I'm only just registering how gory the situation is. Okay. Um... Private Hearts Holotech. Devil's Jew. Misc. Holotapes. Private Hearts Holotech. Jeffries! Lee got the recorder working. So this the sort of detail you had in mind when you signed up for the Gunners? Hauling luggage from Lynn Woods for some robot butler? Uh, what was his name? Uh, Wellington? <laughs> Wellingham? Not now, Private. Where's Connors? He's not at his post. Oh, uh, sorry, sir. The lieutenant said he found some tracks. Wanted to check them out. Private Martin. Tracks? What track? What the hell is that? Oh, my. Connor! Where, where's the rest of him? Found him. Sergeant Lee, grab the case. Do not let that thing out of your sight. Everyone inside the museum, now! Major! Major, what found us? Alright. Something's after them. Spooky. Nice little gunshots coming our way. What's going on here? Uh, I have something with a scope. No. No. You just look like traitors. So, what was going on? Never mind. So, what did we find out? They went into the museum, right? So, I guess that's where we'll go to. Devil's Jew. Explore the museum. Yes. Right. Okay, well, now that's just a dead giveaway, isn't it? <laughs> that's a death claw. That? That's a death claw, Hancock. So a, de a death claw was hunting them? Nice. So we're gonna be fighting a dead claw. That's alright, I'd much prefer to fight a dead claw than like we know whatever's up there is probably cool. Six dudes with gamma guns. One of these tasks seems monumentally easier than the other. I hope you're enjoying your lunch, dead claw. Seriously, game? Jump scare chords. Yeah. No. <laughs> it's kind of not scary when you know what the what the what the horror is, and the horror is a death claw, and totally unnecessary. There better be a piano up here. I'm just saying.
enemy. Oh, I love seeing medical boxes. Take all of that. There's nothing else down here, yeah? Empty this box. Right about this place. Oh, it's fine. It's just a death lore and Bethesda being cheesy. Ooh, spooky Salem. Got it. Witch burning, yada yada. Like if they actually went the supernatural route in Fallout, it would be a lot spookier. Jackpot. Yeah. That wasn't bad, was it? So the question is, when is Deathclaw gonna jump out at me? Hello? Hey. I hear you. I see you. Savage Deathclaw. Alright. Hang on, buddy. I just need to pump, pump, pump it up. Buff out. Fury. Hit. Ultra Jet, Medix. Uh, what do you do? That's accuracy? Nah. Overdrive, Psycho, and Psycho Buff. You, my friend, are so dead right now. on me buddy oh right you're gonna, you're gonna cheat oh come on <sighs> cheat shots that killed me that killed me that's not fair it's not even slightly fair Instant kill mechanic? Not impressed. Not impressed by your instant kill me mechanic. Mechanic. Kemanic. Alright, I know where you are, so let's just preempt this. I was doing so well too, that was that was BS. Just saying. Yeah, rawr. You have zero chance to hit. Why? Go. Right, are you gonna be a jerk and like cheat? Yes. Stop cheating. Stop cheating. It's meant to go. No, this instant kill BS. Cool. Alright. Uh, pulse mine. Straight to the looting. <laughs> Do we have anything? We have Grognak the Barbarian. Critical hits with unarmed and melee attacks permanently do plus 5% damage. Always like to see that stuff. Um. Right, we were already here. I skipped you because I decided to charge in and deal with Mr. Deathclaw. Uh, nothing behind the podium. Cracked Deathclaw egg. Ah, a 
chest full of death claw eggs. A dozen, maybe more. Smashed to bits. Except this one. No wonder they wouldn't tell us what was in that case. If I'd known, I would have personally told the gunner bosses and that glorified liquor cabinet Wellingham to take those Diamond City caps and stuff them. I guess we know why that death claw tracked us all the way from Lynn Woods now. He stole her damn kids. Christ. Maybe. Maybe if we just return the eggs. Oh, hey, Mama. You looking for this? Right, so they were tricked. Mercs for hire. She should ask questions first that's uh that's probably a good good thing to go by because you don't want to be tracked by a giant savage death claw well it's not so bad for me <laughs> just take some drugs uh, i'm surprised i didn't get addicted to anything oh maybe i was no nope, no addiction so we have a choice now we can take that to Diamond City or return the egg to its nest. And honestly, I don't know, this one's closer. <laughs> yeah, let's go return the egg to the nest and see what happens when we do that. Sounds like fun. So, let's keep moving. See what we can see along the way. Uh, not a lot so far. I'll be back once something happens. Alright, I return. We've got an interesting tower type thing. We also have a giant, like, hospital here. But I also know what that hospital is, and I'm going to avoid it for now. So we're going to head up into this tower thing, which I don't think, despite its proximity, I've ever been to. Linwoods. Alright, so this is pretty much right by where we... Ah, it's so close. We'll deal with the quest first and then come back here. Priorities. So... Okay. I take it this is the nest? Yep. And we just drop it off. Oh. What up? Okay. I got a level. <laughs> Truce? Truce. Good boy. Stay. No one has to be anyone's dinner tonight. Uh. Good death claw. Yeah, that, she pretty much says exactly how I feel right now. Oh, hey. So this is what people have told me that you get for this. I didn't actually think it was just going to be loot sitting around the nest, but there you go. Let me know what oh, I can get. You don't mind if I uh, take the bits and bobs from this, do you, Mr. Friendly Deathclaw? Are you a mister or a missus? I think you might be a mister because I think the male deathclaws are smaller than the mothers. I can't remember. <laughs> Can't remember how the death claw thing goes. But we now have a new weapon. Um Death Claw Gauntlet 168 versus 135 plus 53. So this is still better, but this is unupgraded at all. So we'll see how that goes. We'll need to find a weapons bench. Or rather we'll go back to the castle and see about upgrading it. This place is totally destroyed. Hello? Anyone home? Master lock steamer trunk. 
and the deep person. I'll take that light bulb. Thank you. Do we have anything? Well, there's always the tower, right? Let's uh, raid a waster. Hi, friendo. Raiders. But they had to have been tricky, right? Oh, it's so nice to fight enemies I can deal with. Okay, good. Good, good. Okay. So let's head up the tower, finally. This place is pretty nice, but I haven't seen a workshop, so... Yeah, that's not happening. That's gotta be a grenade bouquet, right? Yes, it is. Yeah. It's kind of hard to see against the stairs. Okay. Any more trapper runes? What? Someone's at the bottom of the tower. Cryogenic grenade. Stim pack. Plasma grenade. Then Woods chest key. Uh, circuit breaker. <laughs> go death floor, go. Is that friendly death floor? I'm quite enjoying this, by the way. Just uh, watching a death floor totally destroy a bunch of raiders. Good. Good, good, good. Now what are you going to do once that raider is dead, Mr. Deathlord? That raider is taking a beating though. There we go. Off you go. You're just going to wander off? Yeah. Alright. Whoa, I heard another one. Yeah. They're just basic Deathlords though. Want to kill a couple of basic death floors? Hancock? Sound good to you? Sounds good to me. Especially if they're going to stick around and make things difficult. Hey, buddy. What up? Oh, of course you do. Where I always get totally turned around when they do that weird pick you up and annihilate you thing. You know, take the sun thing? Yeah. Okay. We also leveled up, I totally forgot. And we should do that before I do anything else. Let's take a look. Good. More healing. So. Yeah, the other death floor is sticking around. Hancock. <laughs> I mean, I pre appreciate the bravado, but uh, that's a legendary alpha death floor. And all my stuff just wore off. Okay, uh, why don't we unwear it off? Chems. It was overdrive and. Psycho? Psycho back. Taking a fantastic amount of damage, I think. Uh, 
They wound pretty easily. Combat armor of strength. Strength and endurance. This is good stuff. And I'm wounded. Good. Good, good, good. Chinese officer's sword, huh? <laughs> Can't do. Can't Turk to hate it. Can't hate. Mm. Can't hurt to take it. <laughs> there we go, brain. You did it. Right, we are done here. Let's go back to the castle and see what we can do with this death claw gauntlet. Right. That is the wrong way to see what to do with the death claw gauntlet. So, weapons, workbench. I'll keep an eye out. Oh my god, there's fighting going on. We can put an extra claw on it. Okay. This is its original damage, by the way, 108. It's um, not the, the boosted damage from when we are looking at it in our inventory. So if we look at it in our inventory now, we see that it does Death Claw Gauntlet 150 what? I'm sure that was showing as doing more before. Okay, 86 plus 43, that's 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 129. You are doing more, but not by a lot. Okay. I guess it was my drugs that was skewing the numbers. But now we have a death ball gauntlet, so uh, that's a thing. So if I switch to that and switch, yes. Right, that means we've got stuff to put away. I'm gonna go and deal with junk and whatnot, and I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. I still have the Furious Power Fist in my inventory. The reason why is specifically... Ah, oh, when was that under attack? I totally missed that message. I'm gonna have to go there and repair things. Um, specifically because the Furious Power Fist special ability is increased damage after each consecutive hit on the same target. So while this does more damage if from the initial hit, I feel like this might actually do way more damage um, as the fight progresses. So I'm keeping that until we work out whether this actually feels like it's doing a lot more, or whether we should go back to the Furious Power Fist. Now I'm going to go to the Red Rocket because I had no idea it was under attack. Hey guys. So everything's going to be broken. You're not broken. You are. Yeah, all the generators and stuff are stuffed. That's fine. Ah, Well, my corn's damaged and I can't repair it until I actually have more corn. Do I have corn? I do have corn. Never mind. Uh, poor corn. Corn is so important. Are any of the mutt fruit? Mute fruit. Damaged. Hello, so Brotherhood, what do you want? Yeah, my territory. Anything around here? All the power armors in its appropriate spot. You'll notice that things that don't normally light up are lighting up. That's because um, um, I mentioned a couple of episodes ago I installed spring cleaning. So that's why that's happening. Spring cleaning lets you remove 
things that you normally couldn't, like just bits of grass and so on. Like I can remove that. And that. And that. So. Yeah. Not entirely sure about the uh, stuff that it gives you. You look damaged, but you're not saying to repair. Uh, not what I wanted to do. Oh, it's this that's damaged. <laughs> okay. Never mind. It was so loud. Let's change. probably the least annoying sound yeah if you didn't know if you turn it on and off it makes different sound effects so that's the thing uh, razor grain knocked down no it was only the corn that was damaged okay that's fine red rockets all better now so what to do next what to do next indeed what do we actually have in terms of, we have Mechanical Menace, we could take a look at what the DLC has to offer. Um, I am very tempted. Kidnapping at County Crossing, Lost Patrol, The Glowing Sea, Road to Freedom, Clearing the Way, Greater Troubles, Fire Support, and a bunch of miscellaneous quests. Investigate Pikmin Gallery, that was the thing that um, Hancock gave us directly. Talk to McCready, get the latest issue of public occurrences, and check the detective cases. Well, why don't we do this? So, listen to the caravan distress call. This is an emergency broadcast. Our caravan's under attack by hostile robots and needs some serious help. We're just east of Watts Consumer Electronics. If anyone in the vicinity can come help, now's the time. Ada, loop this message. Yes, sir. Okay. There we go. Find the caravan. This is an Let's turn that off for a start. Oh, hey. Of course we went there. That was the, um... That was the place where the guy that was quitting was, uh... Tampering with the military demo for the robots that were in the Watts building. And we purposefully set it off. What's going on, guys? Swarm bite. Oh my god. I got annihilated. <laughs> Uh, all right. Let's try that again. Where are we in terms of the uh, quest? Find the caravan. All right, let's go to Watts. Consumer Electronics. I couldn't really tell what was happening to enemy health. Which was weird. The uh like the health bars were acting on. Railway rifles. Got a lot of baddies around here. How to approach the situation? Not happening, buddy. 
Oh, come on. Railway rifle? That's probably what killed me. Uh, stuck on the fence. Where are you, Hancock? <laughs> did you just run in and get annihilated? Yes, you did. Yeah. Rifles hurt a lot. I feel like I'm quickly getting underpowered in the Commonwealth, to be honest. The other thing is that maybe I should be using the Furious Power Fist here because it does energy damage and robots are weaker to energy damage. Okay, so let's try you instead. Good old Furious Power Fist. Did all that work for the Death Hole Gauntlet, but we're gonna go back to our trusty old faithful Furious Power Fist. Those guys duck out of the way. Like that. Whoa, 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 no. Finally saved, how about that? <laughs> Use grenades more. Legendary robots explode. It took a long time to explode. Robot repair kit. Companions down in combat can be favorited for quick use. Humans cannot use robot repair kits on themselves. Alright. Did that legendary explode? Here? Yes. Lead pipe of the assassin. Okay, not interested. Ooh, we also have something big here. Porter. Okay. I'll talk to you in a second. Hurts. Turing. A lot of named robots around here. So is Diary. Take a look at that in a second. Okay, that's the one that was on the message. And Jackson. Three dead people, huh? I'll take your laser rifle. Just looting all the stuff before we continue on with the uh, with the quest. Unplug. Right, what was that diary? Um, Risk. Zoe's diary. No? Is it Zoe? Am I completely. Where's this holotape? Those are games. 
guess I went into the wrong subsection. Notes. No diaries here. Oh, there it is. Okay. I guess because it's DLC and the um, mod that does this is not updated yet, it's confusing things. Ramblings. Whoa, this is a lot. Uh, so I decided to start keeping a diary in this little holotape. I thought it would be cool to only update it at different terminals, kind of like my own little collection. Although half the time I have no idea where we are. Navigation's not really my thing. I leave that up to the bots. Today we stopped by this decent looking salvage yard. It's impressively not gross and overrun with ferals like the last one. Lisa helped me fix up this terminal so I could get down to business. Anyway, I think Ada and I got some pretty good defenses set up for now. We have enough supplies for a bit, so I imagine we'll give this place a pretty good once over. I really need to find some good things to trade if I want a new pair of gloves anytime soon. Warning, if your name is not Zoe and you are reading this, then you are dead. I don't think so, though. Raiders are dumb. Raiders are dumb. I'd like to think that people like us are safe because just... <laughs> like us, are safe to base just on their stupidity alone. They tried to steal something off Porter last night. Goddamn luggage-toting sentry bot. Porter wasted two of them. Another one set off a tripwire while running away, and the last one, we think, tripped and just impaled himself on his own knife. <laughs> That's why you don't run with sharp objects. Of course, waking up to gunfire isn't very cool either. I think it's time we moved on. Who protects the Protectron? Ha ha ha, that's a reference. Who polices the police? We found this pretty cool factory with some decent protector on parts, so Jackson is all hellbent hell on making us a little bodyguard robot. He's been working on it with shades all day. I'm thinking of naming it Hertz. I can't wait. I love protectrons. Protect and serve. Oh, and totally authorized to use deadly force 24 7. In the meantime, Ada and I set up the usual defenses, and then she helped me dig around for fuses and stuff. Not that I'm lazy, but robots are the best when you don't do heavy lifting or feel like carrying stuff around. Finally, no, we've got two more. Seriously? So here we are at this rundown mum and pup repair store when we find this trader hiding in the closet. He said he thought he might, we might be raiders and just hid there for an entire day and night. And yeah, it's all gross as you might think because closets don't have toilets or toilet paper for that matter. Anyway, he said we're pretty near this area called the Commonwealth that we might want to check out. It's got a few decent places for trading as well as an old General Atomics factory. I think Jackson's all excited at the idea of upgrading Turing. That old Mr. Handy has seen better days. Shopping spree. You're not going to believe it, but we stopped in at the department store. It's like a dream come true. I already found some new gloves and boots, not to mention a pair of sunglasses that will make Shades owe me a huge favor. Uh, huge favors. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I can get him to take all my night watches for at least a week to get these babies. Turing has the rest of the route chartered to the Commonwealth. We also heard that there's a place there called Diamond City. But yeah, not what you think. Apparently it's some sort of old timey sports stadium. Could be fun though. It'd be nice to check it with check in with another large settlement soon. Right, that's you though. So you guys were just wandering around, huh? Can it holotape? to bring about an age of peace. Do not be alarmed. These robots are your allies, your protectors, and they will not rest until the Commonwealth is saved. Together, we will restore justice and bring about the dawn of a new age. Yeah, they tried to kill us. Ran into some hostile robots today. They were pieced together, like the ones we've been making in that workbench. Weird thing is, one of them was spouting something about the mechanist. That they're here to protect the Commonwealth. Yeah, protected my ass. We managed to lose them. Those things were dangerous. Shades and I went back and picked up an arm we shot off. Whoever's making these things is an expert. Maybe even beyond my level. I'll have to look into upgrading Ada and Hertz for some better protection. 
Right. Hi. My friends did not survive the attack. Thank you for assisting. I was certain to meet my end here as well. Are you okay? Physically, the damage is minor, but I am registering sadness and anger at the loss of my friends. It may sound strange coming from a robot, but they were my family. Again, I thank you for your efforts. I know they would have thanked you as well. Yeah, so if you didn't know, um, Fallout robots have a sort of AI. It's not a true AI as far as I know, but it's close to it. So they do have like emotions and stuff. What kind of robot are you? I am heavily modified. But at my core, I am an Assaultron. My name is Ada. This was the third time we've been attacked by robots like these. Even with the weapon and detection upgrades Jackson gave me, I was unable to defend them. They must be targeting you for some reason. Probability is high that I am part of that reason. Besides myself, Jackson also created Turing, Hertz, and Porter. Our built-in modifications would be desired pieces of salvage. We knew we ran the risk of encountering more of these hostile robots if we stayed in the Commonwealth. If only we had made the decision to leave. You couldn't have known something like this would happen. The probability of attack was high. I should have forced our departure. In recompense, I will seek justice for my friends and stop these robots from causing further harm. It's time to uncover the source and confront their leader. The mechanist. Sounds You'll need like help if you want fun. to succeed. I'm aware of this. You have shown willingness to aid others. I ask that you please assist me in stopping this mechanist. In return, I can give you the schematics to build your own robot workbench, so you have additional resources in this undertaking. You want revenge, don't you? I admit my goal is twofold. Stopping the mechanist both protects the Commonwealth and allows me to avenge my fallen friends. I won't rest until I see this threat dissolved. I owe it to them. Now, we last saw a group of the Mechanist robots at the General Atomics factory. You may find information there that will lead us to the Mechanist. I will follow and assist with your permission. Yeah, sure, yeah. let's go. Let's go, Ada. General Atomics has valuable salvage. Chances are high the robots are still there. So, you count as a proper companion, so let's send Hancock to the castle, I guess. So we also have a schematic for building robots. That's, like, the whole point of this DLC. So, we're going to have to check that out next episode, though, because we have run well and truly over time here. So, thank you all for watching, and me and Ada will see you next time. Bye-bye.